Hi guys, make this dessert in less than 30 minutes with just three main ingredients to prepare this easy and super delicious. And thank you if today is your first time of seeing my video and please do consider to subscribe to support my channel. The three main ingredients you need in preparing this dessert is your sour cream. You can use sour cream or plain yogurt, that is Greek yogurt. Add your sour cream inside a clean bowl and add one egg inside it. The next thing I added is vanilla extract but this is optional. You can choose to add it or exempt it. Then after mix all the ingredients together until they are well combined. After that, set it aside and in a separate bowl sift 2 cups of oil purpose flour. Then I added a teaspoon of baking powder, a pinch of salt, and a tablespoon of sugar. That mix all together until they are well combined. The next thing I combine the wet and the dry ingredient together. Just share the dry ingredient into two and pour the half mix together then pour the other one and use your hand to mix it very well until they are incorporated. The next thing when your mixture has formed a soft dough, drop in your working surface and knead this 2-3 to three minutes. And for more fluffy and softer dough, I added just a tablespoon of butter inside and knead all together. This is also optional. After that, cover and allow the dough to rest for just 10 minutes. Then after 10 minutes, dust your working surface to be dry, make it dry and spread your dough on it. After spreading your dough in your working surface, the next thing is to cut your dough in parallelogram shape. You can equally choose any shape of your choice, but I learned how to make this dessert from a Polish friend and she always cut it in this shape whenever she's coming to visit us or whenever we are in her house and the children like it. And please, if you have watched to this level, consider to subscribe to see more videos from this channel and also to support my channel. The next thing after cutting to parallelogram shape is to make an opening in the center in between the edges. Just the way you can see in this video. 
just a little opening in the middle oh, I've dusted where I'll be placing it then take each one cut and let the other edge go in between the middle the opening you made in the middle stretch it that way and set aside so watch very closely so you will get the trick of how you can form that shape just go in between the opening and one time and you are done I like to work with my dough and set it aside before placing the oil in the fire because it doesn't take much time to fry just three to four minutes you're done and that's all and after that I placed my oil and check if the oil is hot let your oil be in a high medium heat and the next thing you drop your dough inside the oil and fry fry until they are golden brown And when you're done frying, place in your kitchen towel or your kitchen tissue to absorb the excess oil from it. After that, repeat the same process until your dough is finished. It takes a little time to fry, just two to three minutes you are done and place in your kitchen towel for the excess oil. Then the next thing I sprinkle some powdered sugar on top for the children and that's all. We enjoy this as snack or in the morning for breakfast with a cup of tea and children always like it so if you have children try this recipe they are going to like it and thank you very much for watching and i will see you in my next video but please don't forget to subscribe and follow this channel for more videos bye